Hello, Cancer. It's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot, and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for the week of 10 30 through 11 6 2017. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish, and I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. I like to read those straight out the book to make sure you get your full message. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. If you like a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, let's get this show on the road. All right. So, what's going on with the cancer? Cancer. Cancer love reading. Cancer. Cancer love reading. 11. 1030 through 11 6 1030 through 11 6 2017 cancer 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 okay so it seems like we're dealing with um arrogancy going on here i feel like it may be on on both sides it's not just one person who's being arrogant okay All right, so it seems like um, you may be being the most arrogant because I feel like you may make the most money. It's like a big bank take little bank thing. It's like I make more than you so I can tell you what to do. Seems like there's some secrets going on. I feel like this is yours, but it's a general reading. It could go both ways. Let's see what are these secrets. What are these secrets? What are these secrets for the cancer? Okay, so, yeah, the, the secret is you feel like you outside of yourself because you feel like this, sorry, this person is beneath you. You're like, what am I doing here? You know, I can do better than this, you know? I'm worth more than this. Sorry, the camera's just jacked up. All right, it seems like this person wants you to open your heart to them, but you won't do it because you feel like you're better than them. Ugh. Like, I don't know. Maybe you should leave? <laughs> Just a thought. Alright, so it seems like... Um, people you know are, are trying to hold you back from this situation, too. They, they backing you up like, hey, why are you with this person? You're better than this person. This person is no good for you. But um, it's crazy because I don't feel like it's the sense of this person ain't treating you right. I just think it's just, um, you feel like this person ain't on your level class-wise. Okay. All right. Wow. So it seems like this person is going to be free from you before you be free from them because they don't, um, really care about the way you're treating them right now. They can feel and they can sense that you don't really, really, feel like you better than I mean that you feel like you that better than them like you feel like you don't belong so they're getting ready to leave you okay if they haven't already and they feel like you got a lot of baggage and feeling like you're better than somebody because you got money is quite a bit of baggage I don't know maybe I maybe it's just me but all right let's go let's go what's going on for the okay so it seems like somebody may have lost their job So maybe you guys work together and you fired them or they fired you, possibly. But I feel like somebody lost their job and they didn't get one back. And then I feel like you may have been treating them different or they may have been treating you different. Or just lost some. Maybe could have just lost some assets or something. Alright. What's going on for the cancer, cancer, cancer for the week of 10, 30 through 11, 6. All right, so somebody's in their head about the uh, situation. Yeah, I mean, you're torn between two people. You got these friends telling you you should leave this person because they ain't on a level, on your level. But in reality, you know that this person may not be that bad if they're treating you right, you know? So it's like you got some things to think about, you know? Stressed out. Stressed out. All right. Mm. All right, yeah, so, okay. So it seems like... Somebody is turning their back on the situation. They like, okay, well, I know what I need to do, and I'm I'm leaving. And this could be your partner. It could be you. And I feel like this is definitely going to happen within the next two weeks. 
All right. Can't say, can't say, can't say. Okay. So it seems like somebody got some new beginning going on somewhere, or it could be a possible pregnancy going on. All right. Yeah. Somebody's picking up and leaving. Okay, so it seems like you might be new leaving a new situation or you leaving this situation because somebody's starting to act like a different person. And I feel like that all got to do with these friends. Friends is just interrupting everything. There it is again. Okay, so possibly loss of job. Somebody maybe leaving a job could be just leaving you because you don't have a job or you're leaving somebody because of this. But somebody may also be pregnant too. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, and it seems like somebody don't even care. They don't care if you're pregnant. They don't care if you don't have a job. They don't care anything about you. They just like, I can't deal with the way you treat me. I'm leaving. Okay. All right. So we got the Empress. The Empress says, uh, a time, at times you may doubt yourself or circumstances. However, new and exciting times are approaching. A time of love and sensuality. <laughs> sensuality okay i'm done it uh are approaching a time of jesus i'm still trying to read that word i'm done okay pregnancy may be indicated all right so it's basically like i don't know like either you're gonna have a new beginning with somebody else or um you're gonna try to renew this situation with this person but this person left you already you got a lot of work to do okay all right, so we got the 10 of staffs reversed. It says, emotional drama, difficulties, um, intrigue, deception. So it seems like, uh, yeah, the just the way that somebody is being treated is making them feel like they want to leave. Like, why should I stay here if I'm not wanted? You know, people can feel when you don't want them. Okay, so we got the Ace of Swords reversed. It says, a notice of... New birth, pregnancy, increase in family, marriage, adoption, or relocation. So, yeah. I feel like somebody moved out and somebody got pregnant. So, it's like somebody like, I don't care if you're pregnant or not. That I don't like the way you're treating me. Or um, I don't care if I'm pregnant or not. You're not just going to treat me like this. All right. All right. So, we got the Queen of Cups. Reverse. So the Queen of Cups says, A distinguished female is concerned with public opinion, slightly arrogant, look behind and smile before you extend your trust. So it's basically like, um, it seems like the person that's pregnant is getting ready to leave because you don't have a job. But it could go either way. Maybe you're about to leave the pregnant person because they don't have a job. But somebody don't like how they're getting treated, and that's all I have. Make sure to check your sun, moon, rising signs. If you want a personal read, check in the description box below. Email me, and we can set something up. Other than that, have a wonderful week.